Viola, I hope you get to enjoy your retirement without any more justifications on why you want to buy what you want to buy. I will miss you. Enjoy every day. Uh, you have worked hard for this, and you deserve it. My favorite memory with Viola is really tough to choose. Uh, but if I had to pick just one thing, I think my favorite thing was all the goodie packages you always give us on the first day of school as our science department chair. Uh, it really makes me look forward to coming back to work, knowing I'll get some cookies or trinkets or classroom things and that you'll be there to take care of us. Uh, I know in retirement you'll spend lots of time with grandkids and your church and choir and being involved and making delicious food, I'm sure, and baked goods. Uh, and I guess final words of farewell, I would like to thank you from the bottom of my heart for all the things you've done for me, for all the time you've spent with me. Uh, you've literally been the person there for me since the first day at Fairdale for my student teaching up through year eight at this point. Uh, it's gonna be crazy to have you gone um, since you've been such a great department chair and always been willing to help me out and put in the extra time and teach me all the tricks of the trade. Um, but I wish you the best in retirement and know you'll have a great one. Hi, Ms. Blackwell. Thank you for being my hallway partner this year. I really enjoyed teaching with you and I'm glad I got to be part of your favorite year of teaching at Fairdale High School. God bless you. Take care. Viola, from one golden girl to another, happy retirement. I hate to see you go, but I truly understand. Hopefully I won't be that far behind you. I remember, you know, going out into the parking lot and seeing a lonely little car out there beside mine, and it was always yours. We used to shut the place down. We were always the last two cars in the parking lot. And I remember one time it was snowing, the weather was kind of bad, and, and I didn't know whose car it was, but I backed up, didn't see it, and hit it. And I was so worried. I went in and I asked Fran, I said, Fran, whose car is that? And she said, I don't know. Come find out it was your car. And so the next day I was able to tell you about me hitting your car. That's how often we were there together all the time. I'm going to miss the times going upstairs talking to you about the Cambridge students and just shooting the breeze. And I really liked when I tie-dyed my shirt during summer school. So I have a lot of fond memories of you, Viola. And um, maybe I can get together with the other Golden Girls on the Panera Bread visit when things get back to normal, if there is such a thing as a normal. So enjoy yourself, girl. Have a good time. Happy retirement. We love you. We're going to miss you. Goodbye. Happy retirement, Viola. I'm so excited and happy for you to retire. Um, you're going to be so missed at Fairdale. You're really part of the Fairdale family, and you always will be part of the Fairdale family. Thank you so much for always being there for me. You really turned me into a great teacher with your guidance, and I'm going to miss you so much. I hope you have so much more time to spend with my mom and do your girl time and road trips, and I know that you will. You'll be so missed. Bye, Viola. Hey, Viola. Hammer's here. I uh, just wanted to wish you a happy retirement. Really going to miss seeing you at Fairdale, talking to you in the morning in the copy room. Uh, you with your, like, eight bags coming in. You're always so happy uh, every morning. And I just really appreciate everything that we've talked about. Um, all of the advice that you've given me. I love hearing your stories, and I'm really going to miss those. So happy retirement. I hope you have all the time in the world to do everything that you want to do, and I hope you have a great one because you deserve it. Congrats. Hey, Miss Blackwell. I just wanted to wish you the best of luck in uh, your retirement. You're my twin. Usually we show up on the same day wearing the same thing, and most of the students call me Miss Blackwell or Miss Randall, but I guess now they'll have to actually learn my name. So I want to wish you the best of luck, um, and we will miss you. Viola, it was an honor being your neighbor all those years. Uh, congratulations on a great career, and enjoy your retirement. You deserve it. Um, I think that Miss Blackwell is going to spend her retirement uh, schooling her children on how to properly upkeep a house, and. Uh, constantly fighting back against the male patriarchy who thinks they can do science better than her. Hi Miss Randall. Happy retirement and the next phase of whatever is coming to you. I want to thank you for coming to yoga and getting to know you. I truly feel honored to have gotten to know you and to be part of the Fairdale family with you. I wish you well. Remember, 
Just breathe, deep breath in through the nose and into the belly. Exhale, relax. Open your eyes and welcome to the next phase of life. Mwah, congratulations. Ms. Blackwell, I think your retirement is going to be amazing. And I want to thank you so much for being a wonderful mentor for my first three years in the classroom. Thank you and have a wonderful rest of your life. Hey, Viola, congrats on your retirement. Uh, you've just been a super special part of FHS for a good while now, and uh, we will certainly miss you. And I wish you nothing but the best. Uh, we love you. We will miss you. And don't be a stranger. Hey, Miss Blackwell, congratulations on your retirement. I'm so excited for you. I'll look for you around our hood, all right? Mwah. So thinking about Miss Viola, um, some of our favorite memories would just probably be up on the third floor there when we were working across the hallway from each other. Um, you know, just cutting up and laughing about things that happened during the day. Um, for your retirement, gosh, I wish you the best. Um, I see a lot of gardening and sitting outside enjoying the weather just kind of relaxing and enjoying your day not having to be a school um, congratulations on your retirement i wish you the best um, and look forward to staying in touch with you through facebook take care hey viola i just want to salute you one last time i want to just say thank you thank you for being such a great team player and for being great for our kids you are truly going to be missed Plus, I'm going to miss those cookies that you make for us every year. Take care. Enjoy. Fairdale for life. Viola, congratulations. Uh, you've spent a lot of your life dedicated to the service of other people. Uh, great to see that now you can finally sit back and maybe do some of the things that you've been needing to do or wanting to do. Uh, I would personally like to thank you, uh, first of all, for uh, for everything you've done for Fairdale. You uh, you. Hold kids to the line, you, you make them res responsible uh, and account for themselves. And on top of that, you also make us adults account for ourselves a lot too. Uh, I would really especially like to thank you for the fact that uh, through the years, you've, uh, you've always checked up on me and made sure that I have everything I need. Uh, and on top of that, you've been a really, really good friend. Uh, I will really hate to see you go, but you definitely deserve this. Uh, now, I did try to uh, corner you that one day and, and ask you a little bit about what you might be doing after you, you finally uh, finished teaching, and uh, you were you were kind of evasive, and you, you didn't really, you, you said the plan was hard to describe, but you, you gave me something to watch that you said was kind of the guideline for what you were going to get into, so uh, I'll be, I'll let you know, I found it, I finally found it, and I'm going to, I'm going to look at it, uh, it looks kind of cool, um, you know, I'm, I'm not exactly sure if this is a, you know, I, I don't know if this is a love story. I don't know, uh, I don't know exactly what's going to go on, but I mean, it, it looks awesome. So uh, whatever it is, I'm, I'm sure it's going to be great. So uh, congratulations, Viola. And we'll see you around. Ms. Blackwell, happy, happy, happy retirement. I hope that you enjoy it. I hope that it is everything that you want it to be. I hope you have lots of time to spend time doing whatever it is that you enjoy doing that is not teaching chemistry. Happy retirement. I uh, wish you nothing but the best. And I'm really going to miss you seeing you in the hallway at the Fred High School. Take care. Love you, Ms. Blackwell. Enjoy. Hey, Viola. Congratulations on a happy retirement. Uh, your time at Fairdale has been impactful on me. Uh, knowing you has been impactful on me. Uh, when my wife, Christy, came to Fairdale, you were the one that kind of showed her the ropes around the school and, and kind of brought her in as an elder statesman into the chemistry PLC. And I'll never forget that when my son was born, that knock on the door went over and then you brought us that nice casserole dish, uh, which at the time really meant a lot. And I'll never forget that. It's just a reflection of your kindness and the type of human being you are. And you have shown that kindness to our students. You have held our students to a high standard. And I know that in life, um, you're gonna do what you wanna do. And you're probably gonna spend your time in the garden or who knows. But uh, hopefully one day, we'll get you back into education and we'll see you come through the hallways one more time at Fairdale as a substitute teacher. Uh, although probably not, but uh, anyway, 
congratulations, best wishes, and we'll see you around. In her retirement, I think Viola will be doing a lot of baking and singing and not worrying about kids with cell phones in her class. Bye, girl. Happy retirement, Viola. Uh, I enjoyed being your neighbor. You always had a uh, calming presence and uh, wisdom that I often needed when teaching freshmen and being your neighbor for four years was certainly a gift. You always had some helpful insights even when I was new to the building and couldn't unlock a bathroom door to save my life or uh, I would get stuck at the copier and, and you would help me out. And I always appreciated that and I'm really going to miss you. I'm going to miss your presence. I'm going to miss your gifts uh, and your insights. I hope you have a great retirement and I know that you'll spend it with those grandkids of yours and I wish you all the best. My favorite memory of Viola is during advance when she was actually operating heavy equipment and dropping tiny little things into tiny little cones. It was amazing. Viola, I hear you're retired. Congratulations. Hopefully someday soon I'll be joining you, sitting on a chair, having some tea. Yeah, sure it's tea. Uh, happy retirement. Congratulations, Viola. Retirement. That's what it's all about. Um, I've enjoyed the last couple of decades at Fairdale with you. Uh, it's gonna be strange walking in your room and, and, and seeing someone else in there. It's gonna be tough. I always respected the way you uh, push the kids and you work from bell to bell. You really are a great teacher and we're gonna miss you. Uh, again, I wish you all the best. You've earned this, now enjoy it.